This is breaking news. A major traffic tie-up to tell you about this one on the Turner Turnpike near Wellston due to a crash. Jim Gardner, Bondo Sky News 9, up on top of that scene now with more. Jim? Okay, I guess we don't have Jim right now. We do know this is near the Wellston exit, and from what we can tell, a vehicle carrying a crane has tipped over, causing a crash there. Early reports, there are no injuries at that scene, but as you can see from Jim's shot, it is a complete standstill in the eastbound lanes of the Turner Turnpike, so you're going to want to avoid this area for some time while they work to get this mess cleaned up. We'll continue to follow this and bring you the very latest just as soon as it becomes available. Traffic off at the Wilson exit and take them over to 66, but everything remains closed. The good thing is the wreckers are in here. Hopefully this will be cleaned up in the next 30 minutes. I have no reports of injuries, but if you're traveling eastbound on the Turner Turnpike, you're going to have quite a delay. Jim Garpoint live for Bob Mills, Schedules 9, back to you. And Jim, if you can hear us, we uh, missed you off the top there. If you could take us from the top and uh, tell us what you saw on your flight over. Well, I can tell you right now, traffic is backed up uh, from basically this wreck is just right before where 177 crosses the Turner Turnpike east of the Wellston exit. It's backed all the way up to the Highway 102 where 102 crosses the Turner eastbound lanes. So the good thing, like I said before, the good thing is the Wellston exit is still open, so they've closed it down and they're taking people off at the Wellston exit over to 66. The good thing also, the other good thing is that the wreckers are in here, so hopefully this will be cleaned up in the next uh, 30 minutes or so and open up the eastbound lanes. Jim Garpoint live for Bob Mills, Scott News 9, back to you. Jim, thank you so much for that report. We will continue to follow this and bring you the very latest just as soon as those roadways get clear. We'll push that out on your News 9 app. You can also stay tuned to News 9.